All right, guys, Jar6, welcome back to the channel. We definitely appreciate you guys watching. So here's the topic that we continue to talk about. We got a lot of new subscribers here in the channel, so definitely go ahead, jump in, put some comments, let me know what you think. But in the past, I have talked about that. And I've talked about, you know, inexpensive guns, guys. This is the High Point C9. I mean, this gun is as inexpensive as you can go out there. I mean, very, very inexpensive. It is ugly as hell. I mean, it's just an ugly gun. And it, 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 it actually, actually feels kind of nice. But uh, it is an ugly gun. But again, very, very inexpensive. And a lot of guys don't really have the money to go and buy a Glock, go and buy, you know, an SD, go and buy, I don't know, something more expensive. So again, very inexpensive gun. Now, here's one of the guns that I actually own. By the way, guys, this is my little brother. Uh, he has a new channel called Tactical Civilian. Check it out, guys. Tactical Civilian. I think that was pretty cool. I'm going to put this channel down below. Go ahead and subscribe him and uh, give him some love. You're going to see him in my channel every now and then. But anyways, here's my other gun. This is an EAA Windicator. I paid $269 for this revolver. Shoots six rounds of 357, you know, 357, 38, 38 plus P. It is very, very heavy. It is not as, as I mean, it's kind of sharp, you know, has sharp edges and things like that. But I got to tell you guys, this revolver is extremely accurate. I mean, again, this is not a competition gun. This is not a gun that you're going to shoot at a, at a long distance. This is a, a pretty much get off me gun, but very, very accurate. And I really like it. But again, about $269. So the conversation always come plays. And it truly pisses me off when I see gun owners that have the ability to, to buy more expensive guns making fun of other guys. I mean, I think it's extremely messed up for some of you guys doing that and you should fix yourself and don't do those things because it's just mean. I mean, I don't know how else to put it. It's just messed up. So again, what is my opinion on this matter in this matter? Because a lot of you guys ask me, you know, a lot of you guys ask me, hey, if I, have, if I don't have money to buy a really expensive gun, should I buy an inexpensive gun? And I definitely believe that that is the right way. If you don't have the good amount of money, but you know you can only afford $269, go ahead and do that. If you can only afford this gun, buy a gun because this at least is going to help you out. Again, a gun could help you out in many different ways. Just having the gun pointing at somebody or just you know drawing the gun or just the gun being present could deter crime from occurring. So just the fact that you have it there, it, it could deter a bad guy from actually committing a crime. So you don't even have to shoot it. I mean, a bad guy may see you with this gun and he may run away. So that's definitely a good thing. But again, I advise people to do that. But at the same time, guys, you gotta think about this. I mean, the firearm guy talked about this. Priorities, you know, he made a, he made a video a while ago, uh, one of the videos that we have, and he talked about this, and I thought it was an excellent point. Priority. What is your priority? How much money are you going to put in your, you know, to defend your life? I mean, if you don't have money to buy an expensive gun, but you're going out to eat every single day, maybe you should make a little bit of sacrifice and start saving some of your money. So keep that in mind, guys. Yes, buy an expensive gun for now because you cannot afford it, but start putting $20, $30 to the side. And whenever you could afford something better, something more reliable, something more dependable, Go ahead and buy it because I got to tell you guys, uh, when you have a really good gun, it, it, it's going to be good. You know, when you have a gun that you know is going to work, it, it, it's going to be a good thing. You don't want to find yourself in a confrontation and be thinking, man, I hope my gun works today. So again, guys, let me know what you think down in the comments. As always, if you like this type of videos, click like, support the channel by sharing the video. I definitely appreciate that. And God is in control.